Hi, in this video, we will learn how to simplify very simple arithmetic expressions. So here are two arithmetic expressions. What is an arithmetic expression? If you look at this expression or this expression, you will see that I've used the whole numbers 2, 3, 5, and I have also used some operations that you're familiar with, such as multiplication and addition. And I will also put in these what we call parentheses. So I created an arithmetic expression with whole numbers, some operations, and some parentheses. And when we do so, this arithmetic expression is also a number. And right now, well, I'm going to show you what number it is. That is what it means to simplify an arithmetic expression. This arithmetic expression is a number, and we're going to find out just now what it is. So let's do that for this. So the way we go about is we put an equality sign. We look at the arithmetic expression, and there's some uh, instruction built into the expression. And here are the instructions. When you see parentheses, that means you look at the part of the arithmetic expression that's inside the parentheses, and uh, you look at that expression, 2 times 3. As you know, 2 times 3 is a number. So that part is what we do first, 2 multiplied by 3. So that gives you 6. And then rest of it, we write it out, 6 plus 5. So notice, all this arithmetic expression is a number. This is also a number. They're exactly the equal, same number. That is why we put an equality sign in it. Why is it the same number? Because this part of the arithmetic expression is exactly 6, and that's what I have replaced it um, by. I've replaced this part by 6, because that's what it is. And now I carry out this operation, 6 plus 5, and that would give me 11. So to simplify arithmetic expressions, remember that when we see a parenthesis, we, we first, the understanding is um, that we will simplify the expression inside the parentheses first. That is why we put the parentheses to bring your attention uh, to that part of the arithmetic expression. So do that. And in words, if you want to describe this arithmetic expression, you think of it as 5 added to the product of 2 and 3. Or you can think of it as, I multiply 2 and 3 first and then add a 5. That's how you read this arithmetic expression. The parenthesis tells you, I multiply 2 and 3 first and then whatever number I get, I add a 5 to it. That's how you understand that one. Let's look at this arithmetic expression. It uses the same 2, 3, 5. You also see multiplication and um, addition, but this time I put the parentheses around these two. This means we need to focus our attention on this part of the arithmetic expression. In words, what this means is I must now add 3 and 5 first and then multiply it by 2. So when you write it out, what you do is the parts of the expression that you're not going to do anything in this step, we write them as is. So 2, I'm going to write 2 times. The only change I'm going to make is I'm going to carry out this addition and replace this part by whatever I get when I add 3 and 5. So 3 plus 5 is 8. So I put an 8 here. And now, reminding you again, this arithmetic expression is a number. This is also a number. These numbers are exactly equal. That's why I put an equality sign. Now I put another equality sign and now I can carry out this multiplication. 2 times 8 is 16. So going back, simplify arithmetic expressions means look at the arithmetic expression, know that it's a number, and find out what that number is. And these are the steps we go about. So practice looking at simple arithmetic expressions and saying to yourself in words, this means I multiply 2 and 3 first and then add a 5. With that thought, you will be able to write this equals this. 6 plus 5 equals 11. Here, I add 3 and 5 first and then multiply by 2. And that matches with this expression. 2 times 8 equals 16. Thank you.